Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to fix your no sound issues or your microphone problems using Remote Play with your PlayStation 5 or 4. So let's go ahead and jump the video right now. So I've been having some sound problems with Remote Play on the PlayStation using my PC. How can I go ahead and fix this? Well, it could actually be relatively easy. Now, first, I'm going to connect to Remote Play and start streaming my PlayStation 5. So I'm now connected to Remote Play. Now, if you are trying to use your mic and it's not working, well, on your PC mic, on the bottom right side of the screen, you can see there is a slash through it. Go ahead and use your mouse and unclick this. Well, in the upper right, you can see it's not muted now. And when you talk, you'll see like little symbols by your microphone down here, and you can easily check mark it once again to mute it. Now on your PC home screen, let's go to the Windows Start menu right here, select this, and then go to Settings. Now I am using Windows 11, so this may look a little bit different than Windows 10, but then let's go on over to the Sound Settings right here and select this, and then choose the output device. Now this will be what's playing back through your speakers or your headset. So I'm going to choose my speakers, Realtek Audio, or if you have a headset on here, go ahead and choose your headset. So it would say like Turtle Beach Stealth 700 headset. Go ahead and just check mark the little box right next to it. Then scroll on down to input right here. It says I choose an input device for speaking or recording. So this is your microphone. And I am using the Blue Yeti microphone right here or you can add a device. Then you can see the volume of the microphone. You can increase the volume by sliding it right here, and mine is at 84%. And also, if you go back up to volume, you can increase the volume of your speakers. And maybe one playback device isn't working, but if you switch to another, it would go ahead and work. So just make sure the speaker volume is turned up. Now let's scroll on down until we get to volume mixer right here and select this. Now, under the volume mixer, just look at your output device, speakers, input device, Blue Yeti microphone, then remote play should be visible on here. So make sure this isn't all the way down to zero, and PS Remote Play actually has volume on it. Now let's go back, then select more sound settings, and the sound settings page will show up. Under playback, let's scroll on down until we get to the speakers or the headset we want to use. So I'm going to choose my speakers and go to set default device. And this box should be grayed out now. Let's go over to the recording tab and do the same thing for our microphone. So here is my Blue Yeti microphone. Let's go to set default. And boom, that's grayed out. And then go down to OK. So hopefully this quick little tutorial did indeed help you guys out. If it did, go and leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Well, more tech out videos coming up next on your six studios.